Have you ever wondered how maps for Source Engine games like Team Fortress and Counter-Strike are made? Well, they're made in a software called Hammer, a level editor for all Gold Source and Source Engine games. The first iteration of the program was made by programmer Ben Morris, however, it wasn't originally called Hammer, and it wasn't for the Gold Source Engine. It was originally made in 1996 as a level editor for Quake, and was going to be called Forge but then got the name Worldcraft. However, Worldcraft wasn't used for Quake since Quake already had a level editor. So Ben Morris released a beta and then a full version that was released and was able to be purchased as a CD-ROM in December of 1996. In July of 1997, Valve acquired Worldcraft and Ben. They used the Worldcraft editor to create their first ever project, Half-Life. Worldcraft under Valve continued getting developed, but Ben Morris decided to leave Valve in early 1998. However, development of the level editor continued. It got to the point where Valve released Worldcraft 2.0 in November of 1998. The ROM was available through Half-Life CD-ROM, and future updates would be released through the internet. Additionally, in version 2.1, the editor was only compatible with Half-Life and other projects with the Gold Source engine. And in version 3.4, the program got a name changed from Worldcraft to what we know it today, Valve's Hammer Editor. Then, by version 4.0, the program was made compatible with Valve's new in-house game engine, Source. Since then, the program has been used to make every Valve and Source engine game, at least up to 2015, since Valve announced the Source 2 engine. With the new engine came a completely rebuilt version of Hammer. It had more modern graphics and modern capabilities, but is only available through the Source 2 engine. However, if you wanted a newer, more stable version of Hammer for the original Source engine that has many bug fixes and features, well, the community has the perfect one for you, Hammer++. It's a community mod for the original Hammer program and was released in March of 2021. It's free to download and a link to their website will be down in the description below. I myself am not sponsored by Hammer++ or any of the people behind it, and I'm not related to any of the people behind it either. However, I have used the program before and I absolutely love it. So if you want to start mapping, I would highly recommend it. And that's the history of Valve's level editor, Hammer.